My love, the entire morning, everybody has been saying how relaxed I am. There's something about imagining walking towards you and just feeling the comfort and safety that I know I need in my life. I think maybe the stars aligned as we met up in Hong Kong in 2016. From then on, going back to Manila, I asked you out formally. Then, I guess the rest is history. I fell in love with you five years ago because I felt genuinely myself with you. Before you, I only really thought about one person, and that's myself. But I like me better when I'm with you. And in true Lash fashion, I'm about to do something very selfish. Have you to myself for the rest of our lives. Josh and Lash, you are here today because of love. That you are to see, that you are to sanctify in the sacrament of marriage. May your love be always grounded in perseverance because it is only by loving truthfully that you can maintain the sanctity and the truthfulness or fruitfulness of your marriage. In all seasons of our lives, may you always remain persevering and prayerful by being faithful, grateful, and forgiving so that you will always be the best gift of God for each other and for your family. Pinapanalangin namin na naway manakiling buo at matibay ang inyong pagmamahalan ngayon, bukas at magpakailanman. One character of hers that I really admire is her being a strong independent woman. We both don't really have to rely on each other because we have to, it's more of because we want to. We try to push ourselves further in life. Yeah, it's so easy to, to be with Lash. Her personality, and uh, she's never a dull moment with you. So uh, I'm so happy that you and uh, Josh are uh, into this new journey in life. Lash, I love you. I'll miss you. Thank you. Thank you caring <laughs> me in the hospital two times. Really, you are caring daughter. Maybe there are times we don't agree on some issue, but still, you are the best. Go always, you are so caring, you think was such two times I was in hospital, you are the one first to arrive and to get up us. I'll be missing you. She really cares a lot, like she really does. And I'm super thankful that that you're my sister. I love you so so much. And you may no longer be a miss, but you will always be your sis. Aww. She experienced so much, kept her head strong, and whenever I'm sad or have problems, I look up to her, look up to Nini, and then Josh came, and I think, you know what? I'm so happy that Josh came into her life, and I'm like, she deserves it. She deserves all the love that she gives to people. <laughs> Josh is so killing. <laughs> and then Josh gave, Josh gave that to her. They're, you know, they, they have different attitudes, I'd like to say, but they complement each other very well. And my sister deserves that. Josh deserves that. And I'm so glad I got another brother who knows how to love my sister and a family. I don't want to cry anymore, but congrats!
Yeah, I think we were really polar opposites. We do appreciate the things that we complement each other with. There are many things that I feel I can do more since you've been in my life. Right? Who's the better speecher? Yeah. Magandahan ba ng bawas to? And I remember asking Josh, oh, what are your, what's your future plans? And he didn't say anything about career. He said, I'm gonna marry somebody. I'm gonna have a family. I'm gonna take good care of them. And I'm so happy that that's me you're building that dream with. I don't know, you, your love was always very strong for both of us. And he really had so much faith in this relationship and I'm so grateful for that. Like love, you always protect, you always hope, you always persevere. I think Lash would be a great mom because she knows the balance between being a nurturer, being a provider. It's not good for a man to be alone. Okay? So probably in your dreams, dalawa kayo to pursue it, to chase that dream. I'm not perfect, right? But one thing, just filter, you know, and learn from your children. Because when you love, you empty yourself to the one you love. To both of you, your love for one another has made both of you even better people than you were before. I hope your life together will be full of love and happiness. Congrats, guys. Cheers to Josh's first and last. I'm here now with you to try to build what we started. As you hold my hand through life's turbulence, there's no one else I'd rather be with as my co-pilot. As we embark on this new journey, they say teamwork makes the dream work. I vow to be the best husband I can be for you. I vow to be the best father I can be to our future children. I love you, uh, always and forever. I vow that I will never take this union for granted. I vow to love and cherish you for the rest of our lives. And most of all, you've always been patient and kind to me. And I vow to show you the patience and kindness that love demands. I love you so much for all seasons, always and unconditionally. One thing I, I look forward to after the wedding is basically waking up next to her every day for the rest of our lives.
there's no other person uh, I would rather spend the rest of my life with but her.